Hi guys and welcome to this video. So Apple have announced the new iPhone. Every year you have a new iPhone that is the best of everything. You, what you will get with this new iPhone, the new iPhone XS, that you mean is smaller than the X? No, it's the X, the X, XS Max, X Max, X Max, Christmas, huh? huh? That is the huge iPhone with a bigger screen. And you have the XR. So Apple is trying again to make a cheaper iPhone like the C series, but for Apple cheaper is 800 euros. That, I mean, they are quite a lot for a device with one camera that is the same camera of the iPhone 8, probably. <laughs> and by the way, the other features are the same. Uh, same new A12 Bionic processors, new screen, the new the new iPhone XR. Don't have a full HD screen, by the way and it's the liquid screen because apple can't use the words that everything in the world use for the scribe lcd screen no it's the new liquid screen okay okay apple and the big brothers have the new blah 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 nitrogen ice cream i don't know for OLED screen i really don't like apple policy i don't like apple marketing i don't like apple pricing because they are really too high okay you have a 512 gigabytes of memory on the iphone max but you pay it uh, like 1700 euros what the fuck, Apple? Are you fucking joking us? You... An iPhone that is priced as like a MacBook? It don't have any sense. By the way, all the smartphone company are rising up the price following Apple. Uh, but this year, really, in my opinion, uh, regarding the tech specs, the data sheet, you, you don't have anything new from Apple because you have a new lineup with no touch ID, only face ID. And okay, it's, it's work, but not, not too much. You have no choice you can buy an old iPhone, a new camera. They are iPhone X, iPhone X and iPhone X bigger brother and a smaller brother or iPhone X. It's everything iPhone X, either price, really no new things. There's anything new. It's pretty ridiculous for me for Apple to present this new lineup. That is the same device, by the way. Let me know what you think about that, but Really, uh, I can't understand uh, people that are buying this new iPhone XS, X Max, uh, that are wasting all that money for a, for a smartphone because there are lots of different choices. There are mid-range market that is huge with really, really nice devices at 500 euros. 600 euros i don't know why you have to spend all the money with a phone that make the same things by the way because i know some apple users that i have an iphone because yeah i buy a 300 samsung phone or 300 phone the android phone they are pretty shit okay it was a 300 phone by the way you are now buying a eight, nine hundred phones. 
So, uh, stop. Don't buy the iPhone. You have 900 euros. Buy something else with 900 euros. Buy a S9, the Note 9. Buy the new Pixel 3 when it arrives. Buy something at the same price or less. And you have the same thing, by the way, because you have good cameras, you have good batteries, you have a good user experience, you have a good phone. If you pay, it's logical that if you came from a poor experience and you pass to Apple, it's all, oh, it's wonderful. But it's everything paired to the price that you pay. I have buy an ATC uh, Blackberry Touch. Uh, I also try the Xiaomi Mi 6S uh, that will break the touch button, by the way. The Razer phone, I buy the Google Pixel 2, the small one, that is the one that I use for the video and cost me like 600 euros, okay? But it's perfect. I think the goodest camera in the world right now, also compared with the P20, P20 Pro is still good camera, the good, very good software, good battery life. It's everything good. It's, it's perfect. It's never bothered me, by the way. It's never crashed. It's, it's good. Uh, also, other people that are using iProcid phone at the moment with Android, you will have a really nice, good experience. Also compared with Apple. So don't buy this new iPhone XS, iPhone X Max, iPhone XR. No, the XR is for the poor guy, so I can't buy XR because it's for poor, poor. Um, iPhone XS Max is for very rich people. Yeah, status symbol. XS Max. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if, if you go into a jigs with no lights, if you can unlock it. <laughs> it's too dark. Go another place. Come on, guys. Give me a button for unlock the phone. It's also good. Okay. I made this fucking stupid iPhone video. By the way, this has my ideas about iPhones. By the way, I don't like Apple, okay? But I really like some old Apple products. Like with our band, we use a MacBook Pro with the Firewire port because we have a digital mixer uh, only Apple if the Firewire ports supports the mixer supports audio peripherals without crashing or with stupid drivers everything else Apple have nice driver a nice table systems and this is good but keep them new Apple products are mainstream products at very high price by the way because in the past Apple makes the difference with lots of things now the only things that difference Apple from the others is the price is the status symbols and the price because you have Android we have Windows for portables for PC for notebooks that are good enough don't buy apple wait for the pixel 3 by the way wait for the new oneplus 6t by the way try other phones why not uh, don't let apple be more rich than she is but let's stop this fucking stupid video by the way if you like it like if you don't like it don't like it subscribe and write down in the comments what you think about apple why about the new iPhones, the new XS, the new smaller, the maximum one. And tell me, what is your daily driver phones? And what you think now at the moment is the best buy phone? What will you buy with 1,700 euros instead of the new iPhone X Max 500 gigabytes? See you guys next time.